We are gathered together here today in the sight of God and in the face of this company to join together this man and this woman in holy matrimony. Into this holy estate, these two persons come now to be joined, which is commended of the Apostle Paul to be honorable among all men, but reverently and in the fear of God. We note that the ring is a complete circle with no separation point. This suggests a commitment on your part to always remain together, to never reject one another. When we're in traffic A million flavors of your chapstick The way that you keep my heart captive I've known Shelly for a couple years We went to school together for a while um, We lived very near each other One wall away And I am very happy for you guys uh, It's really been fun watching your journey I think that you guys have a really bright future together Cause I can't wait for you to be my wife to live this life together and I won't let you go I need you to know that you are my heart forever and on and on and on uh, my name's Kyle LaHosset in case you don't know me, um, I am Eric's best man. Uh, <laughs> before I get started tonight, Shelly, I want to tell you, you look absolutely beautiful. Um, Eric, eh, I'm just kidding, man. You look really good. You clean up nice, Eric. You're always down for truth or dare. Freeze this moment. Let me stop and stare. Nothing before was real. This is the way I feel. I've known Eric for a while. Uh, 19 years, I think it is now. <laughs> um, but you know, we had we had a great time. But in all the years that we've known each other, we never had a class until we got to high school together. Um, but Eric, you know, he's he's always been such a fantastic friend. Um, all through grade school, we pretty much just grew up together. We did everything together. Like I was always at his house, or he was always at mine. We were we were always at the lake. We pretty much uh, obsessed over Pokemon for the majority of our lives. <laughs> for better or for worse, no matter how it hurts, but you've got me to hold your hand. I promise you the world in your wedding dress will dance to no one's left. To wanna blink my eyes, to wanna miss a thing. I just want to um, quote one of my favorite books, I am in love with illustrations. Like, I just think they're the bomb. In one of her books, it's called, Wherever You Are, My Love Will Find You. And this is the quote. In the green of the grass and in the smell of the sea, in the clouds floating by at the top of a tree, in the sound crickets make at the end of the day, you are loved, you are loved, you are loved, they all will say, we love you guys. Do I believe that dreams come true? I do. God created you as an individual, perfect by his glory and love. But God has also said that it was not good for man to be alone. So he created woman to be his partner and his helper. We've come such a long way. Wherever love may take us to, I'll be there with you. The rest of our life starts today. Today you have made a covenant before God to join in marriage. You become one flesh. Shelly and Eric, you committed to your today to share the rest of your lives with one another. And I think my lucky stars that I took the road that led me to you. Now here we stand. The silver sand represents Shelly and all that you were, all that you are, 
and all that you will ever be. The red sand represents Eric and all that you were, all that you are, and all that you will ever be. The third, the white sand, represents God. I do. I do. I commit all my love to you as I love the Lord, so do I love you. I receive you as God's gift to me. I receive every quality of your life as purposed by God to perfect virtue in me. As God enables me, I will lead our home spiritually. I trust the Lord to enable me to be submissive to you and leader of our home. I will seek to support and encourage you through each life challenge. All that is mine is yours. Until death should part us. Eric and Shelly, you two are no longer independent persons. You are now one in the eyes of the Lord. What God has joined together, let no man separate. Eric, you may now kiss your bride. Crazy because they say, you know, you know. You absolutely know when you meet the person you love and the person you want to marry. Well, I think Eric actually knew that as well when he met Shelly. Eric, I love you, man. Really, I do. Um, Shelly, I'm so happy for you guys, really. Eric, you take care of her. She's a good girl, you know. You really take good care of her. You put her above everything else aside from God. Um, Shelly, you do the same. Take care of my boy. <laughs> all right, guys. If you could all raise your glasses. Oh.